Hey guys, it's Mugen Lord, and I'm back again with another uh, Mugen Forum video. And today I want to talk about uh, this new program that Nintendo has um, for YouTubers. And this is a pretty much like a touchy topic. A lot of people don't like talking about topics like this when it comes to uploading uh, copyrighted materials, you know, from game developers or you know from other companies. And you know, YouTube asks you to take it down. You get strikes and everything. And after you spent all that hard work of editing videos and putting your own uh, commentary and stuff on it, it is a very, very thin line. Well, the biggest fuss, I believe, especially when it comes to uploading video game content is with Nintendo. I don't care what type of Nintendo title it is. If you put that video up and you try to monetize it, Nintendo and YouTube is gonna come down with that ban hammer and put some strikes on your account or actually remove uh, the content off your YouTube channel. So now Nintendo had came up had come up with a scheme uh, now for you know YouTubers to be able to pretty much make money off of their copyrighted uh, content. So if you're a Let's Player or you do video game reviews, um, if you're interested in becoming like a partner with Nintendo with this program, uh, I guess you can you know go check this out. But my opinion on this, I think this program to me is pretty. It's pretty pretty uh, bogus and there's a whole lot underneath and a whole lot to it so here's what I think uh, for starters if I'm gonna read off you know some of the some of the guidelines that they have here uh, for starters um, you can register single videos or or an entire channel so pretty much um, if you upload a video that's have Nintendo content or is or that is Nintendo related uh, if you register uh, that video you will get 60% of its advertising um, revenue for videos containing a Nintendo IP um, but if you have a channel that's just fully dedicated to Nintendo content um, you can pretty much get up to 70% in ad revenue um, instead now the thing is you can either register your video or you can register your entire channel but the thing about this is is if you register your entire channel, pretty much Nintendo have full, complete control over your channel. They will also get uh, game revenue off of anything that you upload, even though it's not Nintendo uh, related. So I think that's kind of kind of crazy. And the thing is, also, if you upload any type of uh, Nintendo uh, related content, it has to be the, the, the specific titles that from a list that Nintendo says that you allow to upload and this is where things get out of hand or things that get kind of like shaky and this is this brings back the mentality that nintendo has nintendo has this rule with the iron fist mentality they have to have control over everything they they pretty much have this this bully they they, they bully people and everything and it's that's pretty much what it does uh uh to youtubers you know, like you pretty much, if you want to see any type of revenue or you pretty much want to upload any of their content, these are the rules that you have to abide by. And the thing is, you're not really benefiting from these at all. And this is why a lot of people tend to like stay away from Nintendo content when it comes to their YouTube channels. You got some that that's, that stick to it. They, they pretty much don't upload any gameplay footage or whatever like that. But this is why a lot of people stay away from it. And even with this program, no one's going to benefit from this program at all. Nintendo still is controlling majority of everything. And then if you're a multi-channel uh, um, YouTuber, they pretty much have can profit off of content that's not even related to them at all. So all the hard work that you put into it, all the editing, all the commentary, and everything that you put together, Nintendo can get, get a piece of the profits. And I think, to me, that is really, really silly. And I, it's really, really... Uh, bully like to me and I really think if you guys like, like Nintendo and you really love the content I'll just say just stay away from this this program period this this is this is this is not good at all and even if you do reviews you have to stick to their guidelines to what you can say about their games that they're they're, they're reviewing so there's pretty much a biasness going on with this you cannot be honest because since you're under contract with them you have to agree with, with their terms so guys i'm telling you right now just 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 stay away from this and i figured that you know maybe nintendo you know 
you know, like finally, you know, like, you know what? It's time, for, you know, for us to connect with our fans. It's time to connect with the demographics. It's time to connect with the people that's putting money in our company, putting money in our pockets. And it's still, it's still, it's still all about Nintendo. It's either their way or no way. And this is, and this, this has always been that trend since the NES. And it's, it's, it's here again. Even with the, even with the partnerships, they have this iron fist. They have this bully mentality. If it, if it's not, if it's not their way, then it ain't gonna work no way at all. So, um, have, uh, let me know what you guys think about this program. I'm already with a partnership. I'm already with, I'm with TGN. Um, network so I, I'm not even even considered uh, this 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 program at all but you know you guys who are seeking a partnership or who desperately want a partnership if this is the route that you want to go then go but let me know what you guys think about it do you think that Nintendo is going to buy it the right way or you still think they're going to buy it the wrong way and this is only another nail uh, in the coffin for people or the consumers or the fans you know that still have that little bit of faith in them so leave your comments and opinions in the comment section below and if you're interested in you know more of my opinions on these topics subscribe this is Mugen Lord signing off